on guys welcome back to the channel talk frank and today we're going to be going over the card necessity breeds and what it says is as you get closer to death you start to do much more damage so the first thing we're going to do is get rid of this card and then we're going to run some tests so what we're going to do is we're going to drain her health all the way down to the core and we're going to see the amount of damage that she causes to my character when her health is all the way down and she's going to be engaging me and hitting me and how much damage is she going to be causing when her health is all the way down without the benefits of the card. So again, guys, this is the card off. This is the Landcaster Repeater as she's her health has been drained all the way down to the core. So now we're going to add the card and we're going to see what the damage is like when we drain her health all the way down to the core and then we have her engage me. We're going to compare the results between the two. So this is with the card on Landcaster Repeater after she has already been dealt the damage and brought her health all the way down. Card on. Landcaster repeater it is a significant increase guys so now we're going to take the card off and we're going to run the same test with a bolt action rifle again we're going to drain her health all the way down to the core and then we're going to run the exact same test except this time we're going to be using the bolt action rifle as you can see guys this is going to be a really powerful weapon in the game most of you know that if you're playing this this is something you guys are going to see a lot of so we like to run this test after the Lancaster repeater to give you a variation between the two. So now we're going to add the card and we're going to do the exact same thing. Drain her health all the way down to the core and then we're going to have her engage me with the bolt action rifle with the benefits of the card on. So this is a fantastic card guys to add to your deck if you're looking to do a maximum damage card build. It will really help you out and complement those other cards. It is a fantastic card as well as a standalone card, but you're going to want to weigh the options and see if you want to be waiting until you're almost dead to be dealing that damage back. I want to thank you guys for being here, man. I know you could be anywhere else and your time truly does mean the world to me. Stay safe out there. Remember that Uncle Frank loves each and every single one of you. Hit that like, hit that subscribe, ring the bell, the whole damn thing. And we will see you guys really soon.